Hello everyone and welcome to today's Pokemon unboxing. A bit of a small one. Small, I guess, in comparison to a booster box, but we have got a, I believe this was a Pokemon Center exclusive. It's the Galar Sidekicks Premium Collection here. Very similar to the Tiny But Mighty collection that recently came out where we get a jumbo coin of the three Galar starters. And then we also get the uh, keychain, which is really cute. I mean, and then of course, the Pokemon cards. So I am very excited to crack on into this with you guys. This was expensive. It was $60. We're just gonna pretend like that's not actually how much it cost because, <laughs> oh boy. But I mean, you do get a lot in here, so. Here is the keychain. It is absolutely adorable. It's one of those, you know, bendy, rubbery ones. It's thin, but I think it is so cute. All of the starters there. I personally have my Cleffa and Igglybuff and Togepi one on my keys at the moment. There's a sneaky code card for someone who wants it. But yeah, we got 11 packs here going back to everyone's favorite XY Steam Siege. We got two of those. We got one Sun and Moon base one Crimson Invasion, one Celestial Storm, a Burning Shadows, a Sword and Shield base, a Rebel Clash, a Darkness Ablaze, and then two of the newest set, Vivid Voltage. So a good variety. Here are the promo cards, which I'm actually not sure. I don't know why. I feel like these have been in different boxes or collections before because I feel like I have this Rillaboom one but maybe not. Yeah Sword and Shield 14 so these were really early on in the set. I kind of you know I wish they would have done like an exclusive set of promo cards but we also got the Jumbo Coin which is so cute once again with the three Galar starters on there. Love that. And then it is just pack time. Time to open. See if we can get anything good. I get really hit or miss in terms of luck with these collection boxes so <laughs> either I'm gonna get something really good fingers crossed or I'm just gonna get a bunch of poo which I think happens more often than not but I mean that's okay well <laughs> hopefully that's not a sign of the rest of these packs because that will be painful but we can still hope for a good reverse hollow so let's see what we can get out of steam siege here lots of the commons that i definitely have Ooh, some very emo kind of cards we have got a drifloon for our reverse very off center and then i might not have this card I don't know that I have this card. So you know what? I'm gonna pretend like I don't have it and say yay and be excited. Oh boy, is the sun. Don't let the sun go down on me. I know it's Steam Siege, even though a lot of people don't like this set. It doesn't mean it doesn't deserve some time in the sun. <gasps> Woohoo! You liked my Elton John ballad, eh? Eh? Let's see what we can pull here, my friends. I mean, I would be very happy with any of the full arts I don't have, or is this the era of V-Car? I, I, I can't keep track, but you know, just a good one. Good one that I don't have would be really exciting. Ooh, reverse, I think that's a, yep, reverse rare primate, but I actually don't know that I even have that card regularly. And then, Alt really off center. Like, <laughs> look at the border, how skinny it is on that side and how thick it is over there. But cool, we got a Gardevoir EX. So this is the EX era. I don't think I have this card. Yeah, can you tell? Look how off center, my goodness. But uh, yay, I will take it. I mean, chances are these really aren't even worth that much. These EX cards, I'm sure they're worth few bucks but like hey like I said I am so happy like that's what I want to see out of these collection boxes it's nice to actually I mean it's good to get hits in general <laughs> but these collection boxes tend to be so pricey so it's always a bit uh painful 
when you get something like nothing but green cards. Yes. <sighs> It does happen though. So we're moving into sun and moon, which means we will do four from the back. These cards are beat on the back. My goodness. Thank goodness. I just keep these in binders so it doesn't really matter. But look at how off center. My goodness. These might have to go into my off center section because those are, those are real bad. Uh, Litten and a Beware. Okay. Well, I have a million of that card. That's for darn sure. <laughs> So, nothing out of Sun and Moon base, but we've got some other Sun and Moon sets here. Let's see if it will get, nope, not in this one, made up for. <sighs> it's okay. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's life. Really. I mean, that's just the way things go. Miltank understands. Looks very... What's the word I'm looking for? Content or like has just come to that realization, that centered moment where it's like, you know what? It is what it is and it'll be okay. Miss <laughs> Drevis and then a Starmie. I mean, hey, I do like the clay cards. I actually really love the clay cards, but uh, I'm pretty sure I have that card. I don't know. I guess we can pretend I don't. Yay! <laughs> But hey, Celestial Storm, all right. Not every day that we get to open one of these up. Ooh, and it's gonna be a surprise. So let's see, guys. I have no idea. Is it gonna be something good? Is it, is it, is it? What do you think, what do you think? <sighs> Look at that Dunsparce. Look at Tate and Liza. Oh, I love the crochet ones as well. Cute little Mudkip, a bell toy, a bag on. Torchic Underground Expedition as our reverse, and I think I have this card. But hey, it's a Mr. Mime GX. It's a GX card. Great. So off center. I mean, my God, it basically, it hardly even has a border on that side. But you can see the thick silver over there. Let's see. You can probably see it a lot better on the back how off center that is. But hey, I gotta take it. I've gotta take it. It's better than a regular non holo rare. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know, I guess let's let's just pretend I don't have that card. Yay, how exciting! I love it, I'm so happy. Okay, so now going into Burning Shadows where we're sure to get that Rainbow Rare Charizard. Definitely gonna get it out of a solid green card pack. We're not even going to get a hollow out of this one. But hey, maybe we'll get a reverse rare that is just beautiful and one that I don't have. And I will be so happy and it'll be great. Or it'll be a Morlow and a Lycanroc. Yeah, that's uh, that's Burning Shadows for you. <laughs> what a jolly good time it is, isn't it? It's not. It's awful. Okay, but hey, it looks like... We're doing a pretty good job at getting a decent mix of white cards and green cards. So, I mean, hey, uh, we're moving into Sword and Shield, though. Base set. So let's see what we can get. A Golden Zamazenta? A Golden Zacian? I mean, that's asking for way too much, but, like, if I could choose, that'd be really nice. Ooh, Reverse Rare Nine Tails, And... I mean, it's a dog. It's not one of the legendary ones. <laughs> but we got a hollow Boltund. Okay, well. <laughs> Let's see if we can do a little better, eh? 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 Rebel Clash? Yeah, you wanna? You wanna do that for me? Ooh, maybe. Maybe. I can't think off the top of my head what the hits are out of this set. But I know there's a lot of good full arts that I don't own and I would love to get. So, I think Indeedee is a full art in this set. Yeah, I think so. But let's see. Horror Energy Reverse. I don't think I have this card. I think I have the full art version, but not the VMAX. I'm gonna take it. That's really exciting! I love Dragapult. So, uh, yay! Look at those babies. They are so ready to get launched into oblivion. Oh. oh, I'm so happy. That's a great hit. Oh, that's a great hit. 
we're not doing too bad, my friends. Although I really shouldn't have just said that. Now I'm definitely gonna get nothing but green cards in these last three packs, aren't I? Sometimes I just gotta go and speak these things into existence, don't I? It's an awful way to live. <laughs> oh, wishy-washy, a reverse rose tower, and a talon flame. Wah, 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 non hollow rare. Okay, Chonkachu, what do we got? We've got two vivid voltage. Eh, eh, two chances to get something good. I, the full arts in this set are gorgeous. If I can get anything other than Togekiss, because <laughs> I've gotten two of those, um, the Alakazam, I think would be the one that I would want the most, but like, I'll take any that I don't already have. Or the Pokemon Center Lady full art, so cute. No one, I don't think ever answered me, why don't they call her Nurse Joy anymore? Were they just getting to be too many of them? If only you could be your full art <sighs> version. That's okay. It's a gorgeous card. I really like it. I just I hardly have it. So. Oh, last pack. Can we get last pack magic, my friends? <gasps> we might. We might. We might. I don't want to get my hopes up. I don't. But like, please, yeah, can we do it? Can we do it together? <gasps> Woobar, my baby! Is it a sign that we will get a baby? AKA a full art, we have got a reverse rare. I have multiple of this card. And then, did I do good, you guys? Did I, did I, did I? <laughs> no. <laughs> I mean, we got a hollow, Magirna. I just have this one. I don't care about this Pokemon <laughs> at all. <laughs> Who's ready for a semi okay, decent, not the greatest, but like, hey, better than other times recap? Me. I am. So, we got some out of 11 packs. I mean, not too bad, my friends. We got some reverse rares, some of which I have, some of which I don't. We got a couple of hollow cards. Eh. We got a GX card and a V card and an EX card. I think that's the one I'm most excited about because I think it's the only out of the three that I don't have. And then we got that Dragapult VMAX, which like, <laughs> that's the real winner right there. So certainly not the worst I've ever done with a collection box, but I'm really just excited overall that I got to do this with you guys. I love Pokemon cards still, and I hope you all aren't too sick of seeing me unbox them because I enjoy it and this channel is all about what I enjoy collecting so let me know if you have any favorite cards or favorite pulls that I got let me know if you have unboxed this collection box what did you think about it did you buy it primarily for the coin and the keychain I think most people probably did because <laughs> that's the exclusive part of the set since the uh, promo cards not so much. At least not this time around, but yeah, let me know all the things. Just let me know how you're doing in those comments down below. I love hearing from you guys. You can also let me know if you enjoyed the video, found it helpful, whatever the case may be, by giving it a thumbs up down below. I would really appreciate it. And if you're new here, hey, hi, hello, how are you? You can go ahead and subscribe. You can tippity tap that notification bell down below and become a member of my casserole family, be it here on this channel or my main channel. I'd love to see you, have you here, there, and everywhere. And as always, I just hope you guys are all doing well. And until next time, just stay well until then. Bye.